See, I'm gonna need this. Merle. Ah, am I glad to see you. Are you really? We did it. No, you did it. What are you talking about? I'm pulling out of the deal, Cliff. Well, you can't, because I don't know if I can do it without you. I said I wanted to be a silent partner. Well, it's no longer silent, and I am no longer a partner. I never said anything to anybody. You talked, Cliff, and not only about business. I never said anything. You disgust me. What are you doing here? Curiosity. I wanted to see if the biggest idiot in the oil business was really going to show his face here tonight. Well, you are a sore loser. Yeah, maybe. But I've been in this business a long time, Cliff. You're just a rookie. You're in over your head, Barnes. You're not going to bring those wells in, so I'm going to give you a little piece of advice. Cut your losses. Forfeit that 20% deposit you had to give the government. You suggesting I get out? Well, I'm telling you that a $32 million loss is a hell of a lot better for you than the loss of your whole company that your mother gave to you. That's a rich tract of millions of dollars worth of oil down there. You wouldn't recognize oil if it was dripping out of your crankcase. And you can't stand the fact that Barnes Wentworth is going to be bigger than Ewing ever dreamed of being. Barnes, you're as dumb as your daddy used to be. You know the difference between your daddy and my daddy? My daddy knew how to invest in the right talent and the right tools. He knew how to pump oil out of the ground. But your daddy claimed that he could sniff oil out of the ground. Didn't need anything but his nose. The only place his nose ever led him was Skid Row. I tell you where your mouth's gonna lead you. You were right about one thing, Cliff. There is oil in that track, millions and millions of dollars worth of oil. But you're not gonna get it. You're gonna bankrupt your mama's company and wind up just like your daddy. A drunk and a bum. I'll show you who can find oil, because I am drilling full out, and there ain't anybody gonna stop me. And when I hit, I'm gonna buy and sell you in oil. <laughs> I think he was ready to back out until you came on so strong. Is that a fact? <laughs> he won't now. <laughs> I know. 